January 11th, so that's part of your memory now. So we, since that time, she made a commitment that she will be coming to present you food items. And that has never failed. Through the able and energetic coordinator, it has always been happening. So let's put our hands together again. Saturday morning, I had my door knocked so many times. I can't even call. Um, unfortunately, I forgot my glasses that normally. Eh? So my glasses are jammed on my bed. Eh? But even the glasses I'm putting on, I can still manage to see some of the things that are here. Should I call them for you? So on behalf of this board, committee of management, the staff, and pupils, Mr. Peta and Chief, we want to welcome you again to our meal team. Our guys, food for the blind. So we can now listen to Mr. Peta, say a few words, and to tell us what is this wonderful visit on this mo this morning and particularly few days to Christmas and few days to another year. Welcome again. Thank you so much, <clears throat> Mr. Ture. Good morning, people. Good morning. Said we <clears throat> we are here sometimes on January 11. On Monday morning with the First Lady of the Republic of Sierra Leone. And uh, it was a pleasure meeting you guys on that day. And I'm pretty sure she has a whole lot of conversation with you. And uh, there was a commitment on the part of the First Lady. But let me give you a very good news. Uh, on the 22nd of this month, there is going to be a children's party, which has been normally been hosted by His Excellency the President at the State Lodge. <laughs> Republic of Sierra Leone, Her Excellency and the First Family to officially extend our sincere invitation to you on the 22nd at the State Lodge. The modalities to transport you to that particular venue will be worked out with the, uh, the school management so that we'll be there in time and have fun and at least have nice photos with the President because the president believes you are the next generation that needs to take this country out of whatever struggle the country is going through today. So on this note, let me once more, on behalf of His Excellency, the President and the First Family, to welcome you in advance yes. to that particular end of year children's party. But this morning we are here with the support from the Office of the First Lady again. We made a commitment when we came on the 11th that we're going to have a three years plan to support Miti Maga School for the Blind in terms of food and whatever we're going to have. And we want to rest assure you, the First Lady is going to do everything possible to keep to her promise. I'm sure we have successfully gone through one year. Yes. And I'm one who still believe that we still have two years as part of our commitment. What we have here this morning is 250 boxes of noodles. That was donated by a friend. In the country, touching lives and uh, touching communities, children and girls across the country. So they approached the First Lady Office that we have this offer. We can ship into this country. We want to say thank you so much for the foundation in China through the Chinese consul and the Chinese ambassador for giving up this opportunity. So this morning we have 250 cartons of noodles. I'm pretty sure 
this one is going to last you for, for a long time. very long time. And I'm pretty sure we'll bring more. Because with the kind of guarantee I have from my Chinese brother and the friend and the past man in this business, he supports the office of the court. They, they want to see where those things are. Going. That's why he's here in person. So he's got five cartoons of tomato and another ten cartoons of assorted food items. Maggi and salt, and like this is just the tip of the iceberg. And I'm sure we'll be here for New Year. Uh, hopefully, again, I'm pretty sure. But even before New Year, there are more good things to come. These are people that believe in actions. When they say anything, they will do it. And that's why they are very quiet. So normally people refer to them and talk and do. Not so? Yes, yes. 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 Talk and do. So three years commitment is still part of our agenda. We will ensure that. But until the three years complete, and even beyond that, yes. we will continue to support this institution because we believe you are part of the process. have the best of the best yes. and we are not giving this is not like a privilege it is your right and we want to urge all other Sierra Leoneans corporate houses to see how they can support Miti Magai School for the Blind to transform it assess their need and give them the support that they need because for us youth are the future I always made a statement the last time there was a former um, uh, Minister of Home Affairs in Britain, David Blanket. He was a blind man. So it is possible for us to have somebody to become a Minister of Education from this institution. But all what we want to see is to give people hope and assurance. Be rest assured that the government of this country, under the leadership of President Bio, will continue to support and look after your welfare. Amen. We want to On this note, ladies and gentlemen, let me once again say on the 22nd of January at the Presidential Lodge, with His Excellency the President and the First Family, you are graciously welcome. Party, and, party time. Uh, And like on behalf of Our Excellency, the First Lady, and HE, the President, I want to humbly present these food items to the Miti Magai School for the Blind through the head, the principal, Mr. Ature, a brother and a friend. Thank you so much.